back with part three of how to paint a nail perfectly, where we're breaking every brush stroke down into three main things that you need to master. In the first video, we covered how to seal the free edge perfectly, and then in part two, we talked about painting the perfect base shape, and now we're gonna focus on how to get a buttery smooth, even coverage when you're painting the whole nail plate. Now keep in mind, painting the base and the nail plate should both be happening with each brush stroke, but definitely practice each technique so you can create a muscle memory for this to happen simultaneously, naturally. But for this video, we're just gonna be focusing on the nail plate, so I'm not gonna worry about what the base shape looks like here. Also, excuse my gross nails from rock climbing. <laughs> okay, so two things matter when painting the full nail plate. First is the pattern you paint in, and second is the angle you paint at. So first off, in nail school, and everywhere, the three-stroke method is traditionally taught. Surprise, this is trash. I'm using a sheer polish so you can see where the color bulks up, since opaque colors just look smooth either way. If I paint one stroke down the center, and then one on either side, look at the pattern that I've just created in the polish. This bulks up a line down the center of the nail, and we're lacking polish on either side of the nail plate. Trash. So no more of this outdated business if you want even, smooth coverage. Instead, we want each stroke to evenly distribute the color. So start on one side of the nail, whichever direction flows better for you. And with each stroke, just move slightly over while overlapping half of your previous stroke. You can see how this is continuously pulling the bulk of the polish across the whole nail evenly. The difference is pretty obvious. Awesome. Now the second thing that matters is the angle that you're painting at. If I hold my brush at a high angle like this, I'm not actually depositing the bulk of the product onto the nail. I'm doing the opposite. I'm pulling the product off of the nail and back onto the brush. So don't do that. Instead, lay your brush flatter to the nail plate to distribute evenly across the brush stroke and leave it all deposited on the nail, creating a buttery smooth brush stroke. So shiny and even. Look at that. Yay, now you can practice mastering the three parts of a perfect polish. Professional paint job, here you come. See you next week with another video, and don't forget to sub and give it a comment if this helped you out.